Members of the Roger Williams University community are expected to gather today after the sudden and unexpected death of the school's president. Eyewitness News reporter Michaela McDonald is following this story for us from our control room. The university is setting aside time for quiet reflection and remembrance this morning and afternoon, both on the Bristol campus and here in Providence. Roger Williams University announced yesterday that its president, 75-year-old Donald Farish, died after a sudden and serious illness. Farish was the university's 10th president, and he's being remembered for transforming the school in terms of community engagement, college affordability, and equity. Soon after the news spread on campus, students shared their reactions to the loss. My mother and my dad called me. They are like, did you hear what happened? It's very, very sad and shocking. He wanted to make sure that every person was able to achieve and get anything they could and have the ability to come to the university, even if they weren't fortunate enough. He would always be there. You know, if he was in his office, he was always willing to talk. He was kind of gearing up for his final year at Roger Williams, so this is just kind of, like, really surprising for us. Funeral and campus memorial arrangements have not yet been released. Michaela McDonald, Eyewitness News.